Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we will learn how to use multiple traits in a single class and what is concrete field and what is abstract field. So trait, as we know, these are similar to interface in Java. In trait, we can declare function or we can define function as well. So in trait, when you declare a variable, let's say my or make it x int and so we have just uh, created two variable so variable x we just declared it we have not initialized x so uh, a variable without initialization in trait known as abstract field so this is actually a abstract field and this one this one is having initialization as well and this one is concrete field now uh, we want to see how to use multiple trait in a single class so let's say define a sorry declare a function without any definition and create another trait and in this trait declare a function that show this also again without any definition so now we are having two trait and in class 3 we want to make use of these two trait so how are we going to do that we know that in order to use a trait in a class we need to use extends one but what about the another one so whenever we are having such kind of situation where multiple traits or multiple classes has to be extended in, in a class so you can extend the first one with the keyword extends and the later one when can be extended keyword with so class 3 will be having these two traits available with this so in this class we need to define function fun and show otherwise class 3 also will become a object class and define show function as well let's uh, make it empty we are not giving any uh, any value definition now uh, we will define our main function where we will create a object of class 3 Okay, so we are done with the main function. Now we will compile our program. So it's saying, uh, so if you can see, uh, it's still it's showing that class 3 is a abstract. Class 3 needs to be abstract. So why is that? Because class uh, the trait 1 is having a abstract field and this field has to be initialized. So in class 3, we need to initialize this one let's compile it again so now there is no problem so all the abstract fields of trait has to be initialized in class which are uh, which are extending trait now let's run this program so it's working properly so you can extend multiple trait or classes in a single class you uh, with the help of extends and with keyword now let's say there is one more class class 4 and class 3 also wants to extend that class so after 2 we need to write with 4 so this is the way to use multiple trait and class in single class thank you very much for watching